Stop wasting your money on dumb Amazon FBA online arbitrage softwares. There's a ton of softwares. I tried a ton. I spent thousands of dollars and I compiled the list of the three absolutely necessary pieces of softwares that you need to start using now for your Amazon FBA online arbitrage business. If you do not know me, my name is Chris Mangunza. I release daily videos about selling on Amazon to help you actually start make money and be profitable and build a six-figure business on Amazon. So if that's something that interests you, subscribe for daily updates. The first tool that I want to share with you and that I think that you should absolutely need to, to that you absolutely need to get for your Amazon FBA business is Keepa. You saw it coming. But you would be surprised as, or, at how many people actually do not have the premium version of Keepa. Keepa is not just this thing that you see living on the page of your ASINs, of the ASINs that you want to look at. This is not what Keepa is all about. Like, there's a lot of other features on Keepa that are a must, okay? The first one that is pretty, like, un uh, that is not utilized a lot is the track product feature, okay? So it allows you to track products based on certain criteria that you will set. For example, you can receive notification when your, the, the buy box price goes above or below a certain point. Same thing with the number of new offers, all that stuff. That can be super helpful. Not only that, but if you go on Kipa.com, which is, as I told you, there's two big places where you can use Kipa, on Amazon listings and on their own websites. They have a couple of other uh, services that they offer, uh, uh, another feature, uh, some other features that they offer with the tool. And the first one is the deal tabs. We can find a lot of deals. It can be useful. I've seen a lot of people using this tab to do Amazon to Amazon flips. This is not something that I do personally, but this is something that I'm going to get into in a little time. Okay, so uh, you can use it to find deals matching certain criteria. And it, the Keepa is just going to return to you deals and even as a customer, you can find some great daily deals as well for products that you may want to buy, but you can find, it can track for you a lot of potential Amazon to Amazon flips. The next thing and the last thing is the Keepa product finder. So you've heard me talk about the Keepa product finder a ton if you've been watching my videos. The Keepa product finder is one of the best sourcing tool for Amazon FBA online arbitrage, and not even just online arbitrage, but even wholesale, if you know how to use it, okay? Learn how to use the Keeper Product Finder. What it is, in a nutshell, is just a tool that allows you to set some criteria to filter the, the, the whole Amazon product database, okay? What it is going to do is you're going to, to set your criteria, it's going to filter and it's going to return you a number of products, for example. And this is going to be a really, not a, a search with a lot of feature, with a lot of filters, but if I wanted to get all the products on Amazon that ever sells rank under 1,000, I could do this and here we go. I have 498,000 products to look at, okay? Instead of, if I were to look at all the database, I would have, millions and millions of products. I do not even know how many products are on Amazon, even billions maybe. I'm not even, nah, billions is way too high. But you get the idea, right? You get the idea. So this is the first tool, this is Keepa, and you absolutely need to get Keepa if you want to grow on Amazon. Do not hesitate to get it. It's just like 20 bucks a month. It's not that expensive, and it is a must-have tools with all the data that it offers you, okay? The second tool that I think you should absolutely get is Seller board. So, seller board is a tool. You, you've heard me say, and by the way, I have a full tutorial on how to set up seller board if you want to use it. Just search in the search bar, Chris Mangunza, seller board, and you'll find the video. It's a tool that helps you track your profit. Not only this, but it will help you. You will get a notification. You can analyze your inventory and pretty much figure out when you should restock on specific ASINs. If you want to try Cellabort, I have a link in the description for a two-month free trial, okay? If you use my link, I'll get a little something. But if you just use the regular link, if you just go to their website, it's just a one-month free trial. So get it through my link, two-month free trial. I'll get a little something. If the channel has been helpful to you, it's a great way to support the channel, okay? So above, uh, like beyond that, with seller board, you can do a lot of things, not just tracking your profits. It will give you a, a pretty accurate picture of your business. 
Yes, but that's not the only thing. Okay, so as I said, you, it can help you restock your products. Uh, you can pretty much figure out the velocity of your products, make some analysis, and figure out when you should actually re, re, re when you should actually restock your products, how much you should buy, and all sort of stuff like this. It will help you get more reviews as well because they have an autoresponder of features that will send emails to Amazon customers, to people that actually bought your products, to actually leave reviews on your account. It is going to give you a small bump in the number of reviews, and you know that reviews are a super, um, uh, it's part of the buy box algorithm, okay? So it's not that big of a part, but it plays a role. And so you want to maximize your chance, turn it on. In my tutorial, I show you how to actually turn it on and to actually have it start working and send those emails. So get to the board, set it up. Uh, to be honest, I do not even log in anymore on Seller Central whenever I want to check my, my sales and check my profit. I just go on Seller Board. That's it. I don't go on I don't go on Seller Central anymore. I have everything that I need on Seller Board. And more importantly, uh, if you want to see how many units of each product you've sold with Seller Board, and we can look at it quickly with the demo account right there. So let it, let's log into the demo account so I can show you this. Uh, but it's way easier to see all the products that you've sold. By the way, this is not products that I've sold. This is a demo account, as I said. So you know on Amazon when you look at the, the if you want to look at the products that you've been selling, especially if you sell a lot, it's not going to load all the products, right? And uh, it's pretty hard to, to figure out how many units of a certain products you sold because you're going to need to count manually every single line, okay? Right here, it gives you a better picture if you want to see all the products that you've seen today. Uh, and you can see the number of units sold, the sales, uh, if you spend on ads, how much you spend on ads for that product, um, your return, the profit, the return on investment, all that stuff. And it gives you an easier dashboard to actually look at this stuff, right? You can get your PNL, uh, a lot of other stuff. Uh, if you want to look at your sales from yesterday, you can do this as well for the for like month to date, same thing. And it's an easy to read dashboard. The, like you have a forecast that is not that accurate. It really depends if your business is constantly growing yes it is going to be accurate but if it's if your business is high and low it's not going to be that accurate and you can select a period for which you want to look at uh, if you want to look at the data for a specific period so if i want if you want to learn more just get the two-month free trial start using it and watch my video uh by looking for chris mangunza seller board uh find the video and you know start 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 setting up seller board and see if you like it you have a two-month free trial you have way more time than you need to 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 see if the, the software is worth it for you but in my opinion this software is absolutely worth it last piece of software and this is going to be a lot of people are not going to be a lot of people are not going to be to to, to agree with me because a lot of people think that uh, this software has, uh, has too big of a learning curve and it is not worth it here's my favorite amazon fba software it is tactical arbitrage okay tactical arbitrage is a tool that will allow you to scan uh, that will allow you to scan uh, websites to find deals okay the thing is that tactical arbitrage will you will have a lot of bad data that you will need to go through but for websites such as macy's that have sales with thousands of products you are never going to go through all those products manually so Always run a search, and you will have like you, you will have a few products to look at. You can still look through uh, products manually for, for products that you know usually do not get pulled by tactical arbitrage. But tactical arbitrage is going to make your online arbitrage business way better because it's going to add a couple of leads a day for you for your business uh, just by running a couple of search a day. Okay, that's it. Do not expect it to be. Do not expect it to be. Uh, to, to, to give you 1,000 leads every single day if you do not run, like if you just run one search, but you will have a few leads every single day if you look through your searches, okay? Uh, the hit rate is not, like people think that with tactical arbitrage, if it returns you 500 products, you'll have 500 profitable products that are going to make money. It's not the case. You're going to look at 100 products. Maybe you'll find 5, 10 profitable products that you can actually sell, maybe less than that, okay? So set your expectation right. Now, the pricing for Inventory Lab, if you want to get, uh, if you want to get, a package get the online arbitrage package okay it's the one that you need if you do online arbitrage do not get online arbitrage plus wholesale if you do not plan to scan a price sheet because it's 20 dollars more and that's tactical arbitrage now if you want to learn about three software that you absolutely need to uh if you want to absolutely need to stay away from 
watch this video on the screen right now, and I'll see you tomorrow for a new video.